everybody. How's it going? Welcome once again to What's Your Bacon in Seven Questions. Bah. Bah. That's right. That's right. I had to we, work out the math. We distill do four the meaning three. of life, mm. the meaning of a person, the essence of a person, the chewy gooey center of a human mm. down to just seven questions. Today, the nooks and crannies, if you will. Nooks and crannies. Yeah. Today we have uh, Mr. Paul Bromwell. Thank you very much for joining us today. Uh, he's on uh, every podcast all of them it seems like right now he does everything i mean I, <laughs> labor day weekend this dude was was literally on every podcast right. oh, any, i apologize any, to I'm all sorry. you guys yeah. not not just any podcast <laughs> right the ones at the top of the the charts you know <sighs> the the 83 weeks the something wrestle you know it's funny you right. just you mentioned you dropped those two because i literally just recorded those two podcasts again today nice. oh nice. beautiful Conrad is is honeymooning with the bride, so he had to tap me in. So yeah, that's Thank awesome. You guys. Thank you like guys for having me. Of, seems like he takes a lot of time off. You know, like what's, what's that about? What a slacker! What a I know. What what kind of life does he live? You know, right? I mean, I mean geez, what the hell? Vacation? What's that shit? What's that shit? Who does, who <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You have you have ninety three podcasts, sir. Yeah. I want you to make sure you're on all of them. Right. Weekly <laughs> weekly shows. Okay, exactly. come on, man. <laughs> well, uh, Eugene. Yes. What we want to do, <laughs> Levi, is uh, <laughs> ah, ah, I love it. <laughs> we want to get our listeners to know you better and want to hang out with us on Monday. Okay. So we whittled down from fifteen thousand seven hundred forty-two questions, these seven, to mm -hmm. get to know you best. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. All right. Question number one: How many pillows is too many? Oh, I like this. I would say more than six. And when I talk pillows, I like them nice king size pillows. Mm. You know what I mean? No two throw pillows. No, no, no. I'm talking king size, two under the head, one on the left to cuddle, one on the right color, and then that vert that thigh pillow, and I'm set. So anything side more sleepers than thigh pillow is uh oh. key, I, I gotta key. get into that. And not one yeah. of those like frou frou under the knee ones. Like yeah, nice size. Yeah. Yeah. I wanted to reach my ankles. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want my knees Gooch rubbing to together angles. while I sleep. No, yeah. no. Okay. I don't want to feel yeah. knees touching knees. No. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Yeah. Okay. Question number two. Describe the perfect pizza order. Ooh. So I'm one of those guys. I like the meats and the veggies. So give me, you know, the ham, sausage, pepperoni, bacon. Bacon. Indeed. G give me the uh, green pepper, mushroom, onion. And uh, I'm a little black olive. No thanks on the anchovies. But so whether that's a supreme or a special at some places, uh, I, I dig. I dig all the toppings. I'm also a Hawaiian lover. I like a little ham and pineapple too. So I don't yeah. mock that. But if I'm going in and I'm going to order uh, something that just for me that I like, I'm going that supreme pizza. Nice. That sounds good. Thin crust, yeah. thick crust. You got a preference? Uh, no, not really. Thick crust, not not as much as thick crust. Although I wouldn't say no to it. Are you kidding me? I'll eat anything, man. Well, I love pizza. Pizza, <laughs> pizza yeah. All yeah, pizza, pizza. Good pizza. Yep. The more the That's better. That's a beautiful thing. Exactly. Uh, all right. True or false? Cereal is a soup. Ooh. Man, I'm saying false. I don't think cereal's a soup. That's a good question. I never heard that one before. Is cereal a soup. It's. I mean, it's it's food for thought. It is pun intended. Maybe I, mean, I, I answered that maybe a little quick, but I just never pictured cereal being a soup. Well, if you want, you could sleep on that yeah, one. We know there's cold soups. Yeah, yeah. we know there's cream-based soups. Yeah, and I just would never put in. those two in the same family. I don't think. Right. Yeah. yeah. All right. Can I have my breakfast soup, please? I just don't ever, you know, see myself. Distant cousins. That. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Maybe yeah. cousins removed. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. In the same family somewhere down. Cereal the line. is a kissing cousin of yeah. soup. <laughs> I like it. All out. <laughs> okay. All right, Paul. Gift cards. Lame gift idea or great gift idea? Fantastic gift idea. Okay, this is from someone who likes to receive gift cards so that I can spend them the way that I want to spend them. Damn the more right. Amazon gift cards you want to give me, the better. Yeah. I, now, do you think, do you, so obviously Amazon's pretty generic, but if it was something like specific, like if somebody came to you and gave you like a pro wrestling tease one or something like that, is, is it extra brownie points? Because they're, they know you want something, they know you like something, and it's like, okay, well, this is personalized enough. 
I think so. I think because not only did they just say, well, we'll get you a gift card, but they took it a step further and said, we're going to get you a gift card and something we know you love and appreciate. So to me, that's all the extra effort I need to show. You really thought about this. Yeah. Cool. Uh, I like it. I like it. All right. Uh, Number five. What number is Mike thinking of? What number is Mike thinking of? And it could be any number. Could be any. It just has to be a number. 23. What is your go-to jukebox pick? Ooh. Jane says. Ooh. Great song. That's Jane, the first time somebody that's said that. Great. Jane's addiction, baby. Yeah. Oh, wow. I love it. That's a great I love one. It. Nice. Mm. All right. All right. This no is pressure here. This okay. is question number seven. Yes. Question number seven decides if you get the coveted bonus question. Mm. No pressure. Much no pressure at all. After, much sought after bonus question. <laughs> Number seven, the deciding question. Mr. Paul Bromwell, how do you feel about garden gnomes? Garden gnomes. Hmm. Well, I'll tell you what. The first thing I think of of, when I think of garden gnomes is grandma's house because she had a few garden gnomes around the garden. And it's just grandma's house brings back special memories to me, guys. All right. So I don't hate garden gnomes. They don't scare me. I don't hate on them. It just brings back fond memories of my childhood. So I can appreciate a, an occasional garden gnome here and there. What okay. I will say is if you ever invite Eric Bischoff to your house, yeah. or hide all the garden or, or, or your grandma's house, I, hide all the garden gnomes. Because he told us that he actually picks them off with a gun <laughs> on his on That his sounds like one. him. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like yeah. that bastard. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, just... Watch your garden gnomes around there. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know what? what? I'm Eric sending them one for Christmas now that I know that. Oh, Perfect. yes. Yes. <laughs> I love With like a little ad free shows, like little shirt on or something. A garden. Yeah. Gnomes. Ad free shows with a. Yeah. Or something. I'm doing it. I'm doing Sweet. It. Okay. We'll, send, we'll send you a uh, a little bacon as my podcast sticker to like it stick in there too. So he's like, son of a bitch, it's them. Yes. <laughs> That's where it all started. Those motherfuckers. We'll do it. Okay. I, I think, I, I, yeah. Thumbs up on the bonus question. Yeah. Mm. All right, Paul. Okay. Bonus question time. Bacon. Is it a topping? Is it a side? Or is it a main course? In my life, okay, this is in my life. It can be all three, baby. That is the correct answer. So topping, you think outside side, the main box. dish, man. Bacon <laughs> can be it all. Yes. And because of that, you've won nothing. Yes. <laughs> but but you can catch him. This Monday on Bacon is My Podcast. That's Paul, right. where can people find you and you can all find, the things? Paul. Yeah, and, yes. and everything that's going on. Really, it's all about ad-free shows. If you're a member on ad-free shows, you're going to see my ugly mug or hear my my voice uh, somewhere, somehow, on a Codron Thompson podcast or show. You can find me on social media at Paulie B. Well, Paulie with a Y, B. Well, because everybody needs to be well. And, uh, but yeah, that's where you can find me on Instagram and on Twitter. And, uh, man, I'm so excited to be here. I can't believe I graduated. I got the bonus question, right? It sounds like, and this yeah. is a lot of fun, but adfreeshows.com. Check Ad it out. Adfreeshows.com. Check it out and, uh, check out Bacon is my podcast this Monday for, uh, for the whole visit. We're going to yeah. sit down. We're going to drink a little, we're going to talk a little, uh, wrestling. We're going to talk about some figurines behind them. We're going to find oh. out what makes, Mr. Bromwell Tick, and we're going to, you know, because he did so well on the questions, we're even going to call him by his correct name. Oh, this is getting better and better. Yeah, most of the time. Yeah. (laughs) Thank you guys for hanging out. Remember, always ask yourself one question, one question only, maybe not only, but definitely every day. What's your bacon? What's your bacon?